In this video, we will discuss the reactive nitrogen species. What are the important reactive nitrogen species and what is the process of the formation of these reactive nitrogen species? I hope this video is going to help you to understand the process of the formation of these species. If you are new to the channel, then please do subscribe to the channel. And if you like the video, then hit the like button. With that note, let's jump on to the presentation part. Our topic for today is reactive nitrogen species. Today we will discuss reactive nitrogen species. Let me write down the topic which is reactive nitrogen species. We will discuss the process of formation of these reactive nitrogen species. And also let me write down uh, the different types of reactive nitrogen species. First one is NO nitric oxide. Second one is NO2 which is nitrogen dioxide. And the third one is ONOO negative, which is peroxynitrite. We will discuss in detail what is the process of the formation of these nitrogen, especially reactive nitrogen species. So these species, they are formed from L-arginine. So that is the starting point, And from that point, there is a important step that is the formation of nitric oxide from L-arginine and the formation is induced by inducible nitrogen oxide synthase, synthase enzyme. So this enzyme is important in the formation of NO which is nitric oxide which also releases product that is L-citrulline. Right? So this is the step one and from this particular step there is a formation of another nitrogen species by the combination of superoxide ion with NO. And that particular species is ONOO negative, which is peroxynitrite. So this is the second step where you have superoxide ion reacting with NO. And then you have also NO2, production of NO2, which is basically the oxidation process of nitric oxide. So this was the detailed process of formation of reactive nitrogen species. I have tried to explain what are the different types of reactive nitrogen species and how they are formed. They are really important in case of our immune system because these species, they are released by the cells and then they cause the the killing of the microbes, the pathogenic microorganisms. I hope the video was helpful for you to understand the important reactive nitrogen species and the process of the formation of these species. I have tried to discuss what are the enzymes that are involved in the formation of these species. I hope this video was helpful for you to understand the topic. If you are new to the channel, then please do subscribe to the channel and if you like the video, hit the like button.